What's up everybody, how's it going? Today we're doing something a little different. We're gonna go visit the NASA guys. Not the space guys, but the race guys. As I just now passed a Porsche and a very kitted out Subaru. Our friend Eric is here and we're gonna have a good old time. We're just taking a break from the eclipse because you know, sometimes you just need to refocus and see what else is out there so you can come back to a project with all the clarity in the world. All you hear is engines and just full on sending. Oh. <laughs> you knew I was gonna be here. I did. I, I just needed a reason. <laughs> and hey, there you got it, Rego. There's, there's your reason. The, yeah, well, what's up, brother? Been a minute. I'm dead. You're dead. <laughs> was was that really on track? That's gorgeous. Fisky wheels, or yeah, fixie, fisky. however you say it. Fixie, yeah. Dang, dude. This is why I love this particular track. Day. Everyone goes for Drift Nirvana, but no one comes for this. This is where it's this at. This is free, too. You exactly. Know. Yeah, the lemon truck. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Buick Oh my god. That is amazing. <laughs> After having a great day with the fellas at the track, we are back in the church lot. Uh, instead of working on that one today, Yukio gets to sit behind and Kintsugi, whoop, and Kintsugi gets to come for a ride. We're actually going to be bringing the car back to Round Hill, bringing it to Ishmael. He's been trying to bring it home, but every single time we try to bring it home, something comes up. It happens, man. Life is a thing. And uh, this means that today I have to very safely and carefully hustle Kintsugi home because yeah <laughs> we're in November and our exp our expiry says October so this is gonna be an interesting 20 mile ride home but anyhow it's time to send it see how she does on the way home Just starting, oh, just starting this car, there was a lot of fuel additive blow by. So, something tells me, oh yeah. Oh dude, let me show you this, I just saw this. Oh, as I was gonna say, something tells me that something is shooting a lot of carbon. And then I, then I looked down and saw this. That is carbon dust on everything. Firing. It definitely was misfiring because that is just terrible. After 
after a very successful drive from Ashburn to here, I will say I passed maybe a cop, two at most, and uh, Kintsugi is the champ. I love this car. I know it's not my car, but I wish it was my car because I love the way that it is. The way that it drives and handles is amazing. Definitely could use better tires. We've already talked about that before, but this car has come such a long way. It's good to see it finally getting some of the treatment that we know that it's needed for a long time. Just been standing here, ogling at this car, and then went <laughs> in, in typical Nick fashion, laid out on the floor, AKA the asphalt, because sometimes, you know, just looking at the sky is kind of relaxing. I mean, that beautiful cloudy boy is just looking fresh today. And uh, decided to whip out my phone and start looking at cars again. I have a problem, guys. I, I, it's, I'm beginning to turn into some of the YouTubers I watch where they get like, oh, let me get all these cars and start building them. Yo. <laughs> no, I have enough projects, but I will say that if and or when I do let the Eclipse go, I think an S chassis is definitely in my future. I love the way this car drives, love the way it handles, and uh, I've kind of wanted one for a couple of years now since we started doing stuff with these cars on this channel just because we've been around them for almost since the beginning. Started off with the red cars, Ruby and the Junk 40. Now we've got Kintsugi. And then, of course, Ian's beautiful green S13. Yeah, we just, we've had a lot of S chassis on the channel, but none of them had the name Nick Lanza on the title. So, yeah, I might have to explore that option in the near future. Just saying, just saying. But with all that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of us going and checking out some real race cars while we mess around with our little street toys. It's been a blast being able to see all of those good cars there. I mean, rumor mill is that maybe Gears and Gasling was there because there was a grayish silver Z putting down lap time. So questions we'll have to wait and see on their channel about, but we definitely had a good time hanging out with Robbie and Eric. And then of course, bringing Kintsugi home. It's been a blast. I hope you guys have been enjoying. I know we're entering into what some would call the off season because let's be real, it gets cold and working on cars in the cold is not fun. <laughs> but fear not, we have projects lined up that'll help carry us all the way through the winter time. And with all that said, I hope you guys stay tuned and stay looking forward to what we got going on. And a huge shout out to all of you guys for getting us to 1,600 subscribers, which for some people might not seem like a lot, but when we were sitting on 1,300 for literally eight months, finally having some growth feels nice. Now I just hope that we can get some viewership out of all this. But with all that said, thank you guys for watching. God bless y'all, and we'll see you next time. Peace.